So as I mentioned, this is a corner lot. You have a cul-de-sac that ends down here to the left of the lot. Actually, those lots down there on the left, on past my car in the cul-de-sac, is, uh, is on the water. So this is a build site that goes just from where the cul-de-sac circle starts, which is about, uh, about 60 yards from me. Goes all the way down. This is a whole site here. Goes up over the ridge of the road and then back down at about another probably 50 yards. So very, very, you know, a lot of road frontage on two different streets. Let's go ahead and walk. You know, when you look at the lot, got a lot of hardwoods. Mostly hardwoods, just a few pine trees, but not many. I'd say probably say 10, 90% is hardwoods. Let's go ahead and walk out here on the lot to get a better feel for it. All right, let's go ahead and kind of walk right through here. Now this really gives you a good, let's just kind of go ahead and stop right here. Kind of gives you a good, good indication of slope. You know, most of the slope on the property is on the back side of the lot, but it, there's, a little, there's a little creek bed at the very end of the lot on the down, downward side of the property. Uh, so you're gonna have a lot, a lot of separation from your neighbors on this property. So, but the build site actually, you know, is, is very, pretty much very level. Just got a little bit of slope to it. Let's go ahead and walk kind of towards the back side of the property so you really get a good feel for it. Again, you can kind of see, I mean, if you look at the lay of the land, Still very, very, just gently sloping right here where we are today. We're in the prime building spot of the lot right now, okay? And we kind of want to show you the back side of the property here. Got a lot of area back here that you could work with. Kind of starts dropping off on the back side. But that's okay because to me, you know, this area back here, you know, you got the kind of creek bed down there in the bottom. So you can kind of see how it starts to starts to drop off here on the on the on the back side. But you know, when you look at your separation that you have from your neighbors, and you could come out here and do a big outdoor area, fire pit, you know, really have just a lot of privacy on the back side of your lot. Okay. I was mentioning lot 46 Riverstone, 2.31 acres, dated boat slip, number nine, and we uh, are priced at fifty one thousand dollars. Let's go ahead and go down to the to the boat slip area.